it was just lovely being inside the body of a cellist again. Mm. My mind was back as a cellist again. I think it's sort of feeling that musicians get. You can feel the music as you're doing it, right inside you. Your, your arm movements and you get a sensation through throughout your body, I think. It may be a bit like a, a long distance runner or a runner, you know, they're, you, you're doing the movement and it's, it's natu a natural movement to you because you've mm -hmm. trained. So, um, yeah, it could be something natural. In Michael's case, his symptom, his sign, is that he can't move. But does that tell us what it's like not to move? Michael can't move in that way that just gives him a sense of where and who he is mm. in yes. the world. <laughs> you know, we are never still. The brain wants to, to move. The trees whiz past. The things bounce around when you run up a hill. Running, playing outside. This morning, I realised that that's a huge aspect of my enjoyment of movement. And can you? I can feel. I can feel your arm with all my fingers. Right. So the senses are still absolutely 100%. Exactly, and I expect this, what I'm doing now, which is moving, yeah. and is, is also something you don't have to... Because mostly yeah. when we feel something, we move yes, in yes. order to feel it, don't we? We yes, move in order yes, no, to this get... This is unique, really. Yeah. I haven't felt some of this movement for a year or so. It's something that doesn't happen anymore. And that, that arm's been dead for well, a year and a half, mm. two years now. Well, that was like last time. It's interesting when you said it went dead. You'd had that that very um, grim metaphor of how you oh, feel I, I, about I, I, the tomb. I'm tombed, yeah. yeah, I could be a mummy mm -hmm. in, in a tomb. You're absolutely straight, and your arms are straight, your legs are straight, and yet your mind's just laying there, looking, thinking, and I can move my head just a little bit. It's as if I've been put there. And I, I feel that way, especially at night. Well, the whole thing is I'm detached from my body. My mind does feel as though it's a separate thing now. My body doesn't seem to, as I said once before, it's, a, it, it, it's, a, it's dead now. You can't make your will do what you would like to no. do and that's why it seems dead to you because it doesn't yeah. feel dead to me no you know, and all yeah, that movement yes. and energy but mm. it is as if it's a, a separate entity now the mind is one thing and I, I can still do everything that i've done before with my mind but i can't with my body so it's just two separate things You see someone else move, and you think, "Wow, I could do that once." Mm. And now you look at look at it, and you try to make the effort to do the same. Mm. And it, as I say, yes. it, it's an effort coming from yes. the mind, and you can literally feel it going yes. down through the body. The whole body feels as if I could get up and walk, walk away right this instant. Mm -hmm. And you feel like you could, like my head went forward there to yes. pull myself mm. up, yes. but but it won't do it anymore. Yeah. But just in that second when you almost, it yes. was as though you were back. I was back in my old yeah. self, mm -hmm. yeah. about to stand yeah. up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The moment before.